When you are giving God thanksgiving, when you are extending your hand to him, you're not just saying, thank you, sir. You're saying, I believe that you are good. And I believe that you are faithful. And I believe that every good thing that happens to me is because of you. And I believe that you will never leave me nor forsake me. And I believe that you will go with me even to the end of the earth. And I believe that though I ascend in the heaven, you're there. Though I make my bed in hell, you're there. And I believe it goes on and on and on and on and on. It is an avowal. It is a statement that says, I believe. This is the truth that I believe. An avowal also means an honest admission. I'm just honestly expressing that I can't make it without you. If you will order your conversation, if you will not allow your math to overload the rest of you, if you will choose your words wisely and offer God praise that's due his name while choosing your words in life, words that edify, words that glorify, not words that that murmur and complain and bellyache. Help me now. So both of these verses, Psalm 50, 14 and 15, and Psalm 50, 23, use the word todah, emphasizing as a sacrifice. And the sacrifice is what you are offering ahead of time. It's not the kind of sacrifice that you commit a transgression and you bring an offering to cover what's already done. It's a thanksgiving offering. And in a thanksgiving offering, you are offering God advance praise. You're offering God thanks in advance for what he is going to do. You don't wait until the victory comes to dance. You don't wait for the sun to shine to dance. You dance in the rain. You give God praise now. You don't wait for the day. You praise him in the night. Your reputation will precede you when you're a murmurer. Hello? Your reputation will precede you when you're a praiser. You're going to be one or the other. You're either going to be a complainer or you're going to be a praiser. I choose... Oh, my God. I choose today, Lord, not to complain even though there's things to complain about. I choose to come with a praise. I choose to leave here with a praise. I choose to live by week with a praise. Some people are complainers and some are praisers. And the real question is, which one are you?